Activision presents a smashing blast from the past. Developed by Vicarious Visions. It's Crash Bandicoot! What's up, guys? It is John, the owner of the game, Master Guys, here. Hi, I'm Jeremy from the J Jugular channel, and I can't wait to play this game in Fur K. Oh, it's a bird buddy, I'm No, the Indian Bandicoot. Like, y'all are playing the wrong version of this game. Microsoft bought this shit. We're Xbox players now. Me and John are the actual, legit Crash fans. Y'all are please, fake as fuck. Please, please, fuck you. Please, oh, fuck shit. you. I am, I am the legit Crash fan. I played the fucking original, and I'm gonna Wait, hate no, it. No, nope, it's Xbox. All right, all right, shut Xbox up and let Sean go. go. God damn you. Crash is, Crash is gonna... Crash is gonna chill. Wait, Sean is here? Yeah, dude, next week, yeah, next Sean's here. Fuck oh, it. shit, Sean, hi. <laughs> Me too, fuck, hi, I'm Sean the Amkinager, what's up? <laughs> He's actually yeah, in a video. This is why Mark, this is why Mark shouldn't be the not last one. <laughs> Mom, Dad, stop fighting. <laughs> But yes, guys, we welcome to you a brand new series here in this channel, Never Before Done. We're going to be doing Crash Bandicoot, the insane trilogy, because fuck Sonic, fuck Mario. This is the real platformer right here. And oh man, this is going to be very experimental, but I really hope you guys do like this because I get to try to do some Crash content. Spice things up because people people bully me that I do two things in this channel, but I'm going to do three instead. No, no one bullies you. We don't. No one doesn't. We have no one actually bullying. gives me. Oh, oh, shit. No one we, gives me we ideas. Bullying. He we helps bullying me. you all the time. Oh, oh fuck off! Are you gonna <laughs> keep right, sucking right. nuts? Look here. It, look at here, Jeremy. <laughs> I may bully the poor kid, but don't act like you don't bully the poor kid. You know, I'm I not... thought you. I thought I. You said, I know you said poor kid, but I thought you said the Puerto Rican, and I'm like, oh, <laughs> it's not all about you. No, Mark. that's for another day. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, regardless though, we're we're gonna be doing this on all versions from literally legit all versions that you're seeing right here and such, as you can see on screen as as I transition through. Um, yeah, it's kind of funny. But yeah, we're starting 100 percent all these games and such, so it'll be a fun time with all gems, all boxes, and we're gonna go through a new game. Each part we're gonna go through a 45 minute timer. It's gonna be just a playthrough, no versus, no race. So they're just for fun. We're all gonna have fun. Wait, so we're we're not gonna stop at Qualicon? We're actually just playing for 45 minutes? Yes. No, because I, I oh, guarantee no. you by the time 45 minutes is up, someone is still gonna be on Papu Papu or just a few days after. <laughs> we're not all that we're not all we're not worse. We're not all that bad. Alright, come on. You were the last, <laughs> the you know last what? time. We did anyway, a practice. Can we start? Yeah, we're gonna start now. New game now. Go. Uh just oh, over I'll save, yeah, let's do that. Over, overwrite save, yeah, because we totally didn't record this. <laughs> this <laughs> start, did you start your timer? Did you start your timer? Not yet. I'm doing it as I start the level. I'm not counting this. All right, I, since since we're all here, since we're still early, is, did everybody hit the record button? Are we all good? Yes, I did. I've been recording right. for I'm, five minutes and forty seconds. I've been recording. I'm sharing my OBS, so you can fact check me if I'm not. Yeah, you can also you can also check mine too. <laughs> As soon as he said that, Jeremy, I went to the Discord and it said Jux has minimized their application. I'm like, Jeremy, you lying fuck. Bastard. <laughs> I'm eating more from you. I'm drinking so orange the, the, talk. Drinking so did they expand talk. upon more of the remake in the original for this cutscene? They do. Yes. Yeah, they, they, they added it. I mean, you can clearly tell. I'm already done. You guys are like a quarter of the way left. So they, um, this part. The script is the same, they just, they flesh out the animations and such more. Yeah. Instead of Crash just going into the thing and then, okay, I'm gonna walk off now, it's like, oh, this thing, and then he just turns to a failure. Oh my god, Crash yeah. said, uh-oh, how adorable. And, and Tana also kicks ass instead of just standing there with her mouth open. Yeah, she punches a guy. <laughs> she kicks ass instead of ass kicked. Yeah. And yeah, yet she's still getting up. Crash, Crash Bandicoot promoting strong female women. I mean, to be fair, that didn't really happen more until we got to It's About Time. Pretty much. Well, it's about time we got some strong female women. Hell yeah. Yeah, look at Coco. Four five minutes, 45 minutes start now. All right, cool. Yeah. All right, let's see how long I get stuck on the first level again. All right, I can't wait to see who's at Papu Papu by minute 30. <laughs> that would probably be me again. I was going to say, wasn't it, I think it was more Ripper Roo that we were more stuck on, but yeah. Dude, Whatever. I'm gonna I'm gonna miss the slide actually because oh. I've been playing a lot of Crash uh, 2 lately and oof. 
Actually, wait, I didn't hit a checkpoint. I could just die. Because, <sighs> like, I already lost an Aku Aku by touching a crab. Oh I'll save here, actually. <laughs> That's what you said by touching a crab. I'm like, who shit? <laughs> who shit <laughs> here? Who shit it? <laughs> At least Crash will give me will, will give me a break Whoever from sliding on stuff. I mean, yeah. Nah, cause I've been sliding. Nice. But and I got hit by a turtle. God damn it! I'm, I'm becoming Noah now. I'm just getting hit by turtles. Oh my god! Oh. I almost fucked that you up. You can afford to be Noah. I can't. That would <laughs> kill. He has to be someone else. Who, he has to be Garland the Great. Who, what? Mm -hmm. Why? Why Garland the Great? <laughs> Gar Garland the Great, 100% of this game with no issues, no deaths, no problems. And one Which run. Was, I mean, I don't, I don't know. This is... Like in one run? And well, oh. yeah. I mean, he has a playthrough of it on his channel, but. God damn it! I already died for I messed up the fucking boxes at the right path. I mean, to oh. be fair, it's oh, not you the... mother... fuck. There are people who are doing like crazier things, but that's still impressive. Like I've seen people go through the entire Dark Souls, or at least one guy go through the entire Dark Souls franchise without getting hit. Or right, speaking of that, this game oh, is not the Dark Souls or... of like a platform. It's not, it's not. If you can't beat this yeah. game, you fucking <laughs> suck. What I'm playing is the Dark Souls of platformers. Even then, if you 100 percent it, it's yeah, a sure. joke. Shut up. I know, but <laughs> well, nobody laughed. I laughed. I laughed because Mister gotta like calculate everything. Piece of okay. shit. I miss you, man. you know what? Fuck you. I don't care. <laughs> Wait, are you saying Sean is a competitive Crash Bandicoot player? <laughs> He's no a competitive player. Anything, anything about player. that melee player? Uh, <laughs> I'm not a competitive everything player. Yeah, if you were, we probably wouldn't be friends. Damn. Damn, okay. Because <laughs> I would hey, have to kill myself. Hey, Sean, would you play competitive melee? Competitive melee? In broad daylight. Yeah. Uh, uh, no, I, was, probably, I probably uh, would not do that. I would. I don't want to learn wave dashing. I'll just play the game. I don't know my game has wave dashing. Dash. It's, it's not even the worst thing. Whatever. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> I don't care if it's not the worst thing. I don't even play, like, I'm not even competitive when it comes to Smash. And then Melee is a step above that. To be fair, well, actually, you actually did come up as a little bit of a competitive Ultimate player, I'm not gonna lie, actually. What? You actually, well, I like, well, it's, I don't well, know there's no strats. I don't know well, like, which Sean that you meet, that you met at first, but there's no shot. No, I saw no, Sean as like a, uh, he's just no, a, no, no, crotchy, no, no. Like, a crotchy what was, guy. What I was Sean saying is, is that, a like, really kept Competitive, a casual player. Yeah, what I was what I was I'm saying is, not the kind of person who's gonna learn every little mechanic. It's just that I don't like losing, but no one likes losing. Can I do box gem and the right. jungle rollers or no? I need a gem right no. now. No. Okay. You cannot. I was just it's saying that because most, most of this first. Uh, oh yeah, I can cannot. see why. I see why now. So, I, I yeah. was just saying that because Sean actually taught me, like, like was the one that told me that Samus kills up, like, with her up throw, and I'm like, oh fuck yeah, and that's how I beat Kevin with <laughs> just... it. Samus is the only character in that game where I actually like know how to play, but even then I haven't played Smash in a while, so I'm guaranteeing yeah. I'm all rusty here. But I actually did a lot of practicing with Samus and like looked up some of their combos and stuff. Her up, her yeah. up throw is ridiculously yeah. powerful. Yeah, I didn't know that until like I, we were playing once and you told me like, oh yeah, just up throw. And I'm like, oh fuck, that actually is good. <laughs> it's really good. Samus is really good. Quite yeah, she's, yeah, she's good, all right. Zero suit is <laughs> Zero Suit okay. Samus used to be a lot more busted than she is now. Well, she, uh, she was doing some busting. Dark Samus. She was doing some busting, all right. Yeah, Zero Suit Samus is way You know what busted. else is good? When I was playing through Crash Team Racing the other day, the Trophy Girls in PS1. Man. They have jiggle yeah. physics. There's nothing better than uh, jiggle PS1 boobies. <laughs> yeah, those tr yeah, those triangle titties, yeah. They, they have triangle titties. They have As more. Honestly, they're, they look more like boobs than Laura Croft's. You mean Breeze? And Laura Croft was supposed to be the, uh, wasn't she the it's hottie of the video game era? Damn. Maybe. It's like I had um, a wall there. What the fuck wasn't happened? There? I was there. I was barely there. I don't remember. She's looking too late. out. We were out. If I was like around that time frame, and then I had a thing for Laura <laughs> Croft. <laughs> yeah. It wouldn't be her in the game, does not it? It'd be probably her like on posters, like the renders. Yeah. No. Yeah. The renders. The renders. They do what they were doing with her. The PlayStation One, man, those pointy, those no, those those fucking pyramids. You could probably shank though with those. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Your boobs. Was no, it fucking Tana on the PlayStation One's got a better like set than goddamn yeah. Laura Croft? 
was it, that's was, true. Wasn't actually. there wasn't there rumors that there was a <laughs> nude a, like a nude cheat code or something? For for Laura Croft, probably. Yeah. It's a rumor, yeah, but it's not true. Yeah, that's true. I mean, nowadays there's probably a mod for it. Well, uh, yeah, a mod, but shit. Damn, no, are... I think I might want to do more uh, Tomb Raider on my channel. Heck no, you nah. sick, you sick fox. <laughs> nah, I'm not gay, but I prefer Dude Raider. Dude Raider. Dude Raider. I'm charged. You know what that fucking? You know, oh, yeah. Charted. You wanna know what Dude? You know what Dude Raider is? I was gonna say that's a that's fucking Temple Run. Oh, gross, I have not heard that game in a uh, minute. How to say you're young without saying that. you're young. Hey, you can play that Crash Temple Run uh, game, actually. Dude, Temple I Run just that. shows your age. Not anymore. Temple Run, hey, Temple Run is one of those Wait, games that's like, if it's, if it's, it's in yeah, a fucking... Down. Oh, it runs on... Oh, it actually runs online? You only put in a lot of hours in Temple Run back in the day. Bro, Temple Run fits in the same realm as, like, Fruit Ninja and Jetpack Joyride, Subway oh, Surfers. God. I remember Jetpack Joyride. Joyride. That was fun. Subway Surfers, fucking Sonic Dash. I was addicted to Subway Surfer, holy fuck. I, the only time I ever played what? Subway Surfers is when we went to the arcade. I just, well, I'll just I, say I, you're young without saying you're young. Hey, those are Tom, that's Tom's game there, Subway Surfers. Yeah, that, I spent like the whole fucking time in the arcade playing just that. It got like, except like a thousand, um, tickets. Yeah. yeah. I, I think, I think I was generally like, had an unhealthy obsession with Subway Surfers. Cause like, I was, like, I had some of my old, like, high school friends like i don't talk to any of them anymore but like like who does we used to, like face, like facebook like ha would keep track of your scores so i would try to beat the highest score of my of, like for my high school i'm like I, I think i just generally had an unhealthy addiction towards it and i know the person that's in that was in first on the leaderboard was some rich motherfucker that would just buy the fucking blue keys so really it was an unfair advantage but i tried to do it the poor way <laughs> yeah so, let's go poor well, Real OGs remember when they got a Windows computer, it always came with Sonic Dash. Ooh, yeah. Real OGs remember pinball. Dude, I took out my fucking. Oh, no. We got 3D no, pin pinball. No, yeah. Space Cadet pinball. You, you know, you had the internet and you played pinball for a while. Dude, like, no dude I have Space I have, Space Cadet I have that on my computer. Space Cadet pinball, fucking solitaire, minesweepers. Oh, God. I used to love playing uh, solitaire. Oh my I used God. to play my solitaire mom, my mom in high solitaire. school. Before I, before school starts, I would play solitaire. And if I lose, I knew my day was going to be bad. It was like <laughs> laughing, <laughs> fortune telling. It was kind of true funny. Just sick how the day went. Wasn't yeah, exactly. It, was it level boulders in Uncharted? In one of the Uncharted games? <laughs> yeah. Yes. yes. You play the boulders. You play the boulders level on Uncharted Four briefly. That's crazy. I, I just remember yeah, seeing that, and I was like, "What the fuck?" Nate, yeah, because Nate plays the PlayStation One uh, Crash Bandicoot, and also fun fact: if you play Crash Bandicoot Two, the Insane game, the Insane trilogy on PS4, uh, Crash uh, Crash and Coco are watching Uncharted Four in their computer, or Coco's cool. watching Uncharted Four in their computer. Can't you, cool. can't you see Nathan Drake as a pitcher yeah. in Crash Three? Yes, yes, in Crash Three. Yes, you're right. But that's only in their PlayStation counterpart, obviously. They replace it with other shit in the other versions for obvious reasons. See, this is why the PlayStation version is the best one. I mean, I mean, I I only played the PlayStation version, so I don't know. What did they replace it with? I don't remember, but they don't have them anymore. I just know another uh, version. Well, they just remove it? They removed, they replaced it with something else. I know for that. I know for a fact, but it's like, what they replaced? Well, I think the computer one just has nothing. Upstream, I need a gem, right? I can't do box gem now? Yes, you need a gem. Okay. It's the second stream level you can do uh, first time to get the box yeah, gem. I'm going to be asking you all this. I, can't, can't, I keep forgetting. If what, could... That's why we're here. Yes. Plus, it's That's fun. I mean, That's it's why. also, I'd say, just not to make a solo let's play. That's why side by sides are fun. Yeah. So I think it's are actually pretty fun, honestly, because you're playing a game and you're just chilling with your friends, honestly. I yeah. think it's, I think honestly, like, if you can't really get it, if you find it hard to just play a game on your own, I feel like side-by-sides are the best way to play. So you can suffer together. Crash is currently well, rolling around. Does that mean we're all going to yeah. play Mario's Time Machine together? Why? No. No. We're going to play Crash Orange. Or no, Crash yeah, Orange, we'll sorry. Fuck you. No, no, I'll take, no, I'll take the, I'll take the Time Machine one now. No, I think I'll take an ass kicking instead, thank you. <laughs> I think, I think I'd rather actually be gay <laughs> than play that. <laughs> Being gay, what the fuck? No, there's nothing wrong with well, 
There's nothing wrong with okay, that. Good news. Just... You already are. Da -da 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 -da. I knew it. Good news, and everyone. It... You know, you... you know, Jeremy, you're a hero. Everyone here is a hero because I um, need a hero. Because here's the thing. I'm enough for a hero for the Except summer. Mark. Here's the thing. This oh. wasn't the plan for like a year, almost, but it was very complicated to get this started. And all of a sudden, it's like, yeah, let's have everybody here to do this. All the Crash fans, we almost all of them. We need to explain the the true history of this project. So. Back in the back in the nineties, okay. So back in the glory days, the original plan was for John, because you know, being peer pressured by Jeremy, um, he wanted to do it like the same style as the Pokemon thing. So it's like you know, how he plays it, like he plays the insane version, and then me or Noah or Sean get to play the PS One games. Now, thank God we didn't do that because I was assigned with Crash One, and I would much rather die than play Crash Crash One OG. But um, harsh. But yeah, we were having a lot of scheduling conflicts, and then this was just on the back burner for a while until we had this, and I realized I was fired and replaced by Jeremy, and I guess they had a completely different idea. There was a lot of miscommunications, but then ultimately, we, we decided to play all the versions of Crash 1, 2, and 3, you know? And thus, we're here yeah. together. The That's funny a part is, I it, it came from a half being serious, half joke for me. <laughs> I'll say that I'm like, let's just play all the versions. Oh and my then, god. And then, jo and, and then John's like, that's, that's genius. genius. You're hired. And, and to be fair, I was never I'm meant to be a part of this. Now. I was never meant to be a part of this, and I was very confused when I got thrown in and kicked out. <laughs> you know, that was funny. That was, that was, a, that was a day. You know, here's another thing, too. Like, there's why I thank no, God, it's, too. It's, it's how I found out, too, that was hilarious, because I see it in the calendar, the Project Ask game, and I'm like, oh, we're starting it. Oh, that's cool. But I never got the, the group invite, and I'm like, wait. Was I just kicked out and replaced for Jeremy again? <laughs> you said it as if it's a very offensive thing. You should be honored. It's the like it's a common thing. <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's the second time this happened, but the first time it never happened, so I guess it doesn't count. But yeah, I remember, I, Noah brought it up, but remember the, the the TGMG Direct, where Jeremy was originally wanted to do an 06 project, and <laughs> it was basically the same cast as Noah's 06 playthrough, but the only difference is that Jeremy Jesus replaced- Jesus Christ, Crash is dying! <laughs> I just- it's 48 bucks just hitting that motherfucker in a row, you're looking at my screen. God damn! Yes! <laughs> Huh? <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> it just has the was... wasted from GTA right there, and the screen goes great out. Rolling Stone. The only thing is, too, is that Sonic goes like Project 06 is a thing now, to where it's like, why would I want to do 06? Plus, I, uh, it's too much now. Can't wait to be here for about half an hour. Also, here's another thing too I want to mention. I mean, I'm still not saying no to an 06 playthrough. You know, that game is like secretly my favorite video game of all time. It's possibly in the works. It's possibly secretly, bitch. That was the first thing you ever said to. It was like the top. Like, see, I say it secretly because it's actually not, but like. No, I, 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 I refuse to believe. No, I, I think you're lying to me. I think Project 06. I no, think I believe him. Have you heard his opinions before? Come on, dog. I believe him. No, no, like, I would rather play Frontiers of Earth 06, but like, 06 is just a personal favorite game. Okay, I think the so thing with Noah is, like, that was like in the top 100 list of things he said when I first met him. Like, yeah, 06 is my favorite Sonic game. I'm sorry, Nani? No, for me, it was that 06. <laughs> I don't think I did you know, that. I don't know. He, for I'm me, he sure said it was a good game. No, for me, it was that 06 was better than Adventures 1 and 2, which was like a haul. <laughs> it got a haul from all of us. Slam <laughs> dunk crash in that fucking hole. Goddamn. Oh, I'm having a better uh, one than the last one. I'm still having fucking shitty luck at Hogwild right now. Oh, well, oh, thank God, you took so the I can't get the box on Rolling Stones, I'm pretty sure, right? Ah, oh, damn! What what level? Sons and Rolling Stones? No. Okay. Yeah. No. I figured, I, I, remember, I still remember that. Here's another thing, too, you're, like, real quick. You're really not gonna get a- the only gems that you're probably gonna get on Island 1 is the first level and boulders, that's about it. Yeah, that's it. And... Uh, up- no, and up the, the creek is- the hog level. The hog level? Yeah, the second island. The hog level? I was gonna say up the creek is, uh... Or upstream, I can't remember which is the second one, but you can get the gym in that, but oh, that's Jesus Island 2. Christ. Here's another thing, too. What got, what got me 100% Crash games, because I was very casual when I first did this, I was bullied into 100%ing them. Jesus. Because, at for, for the initial idea, I also was going to pull a Shadow of the Hedgehog for Jeremy's playthrough and literally just watch y'all play it. But it was like, no, nah, you're playing it. Don't be lazy. It's like, damn. Yeah. 
And then, yeah, they told me See, to 100% it. I was like, fuck. I guess I gotta have to do know, it. I knew you, knew you weren't talking to me because I would have been like, oh, yeah, fuck. I'll fucking play the Crash games for you. It's on your throne, your, your majesty. I'll fucking play the games. No, and, and, but the thing is about the Shadow the Hedgehog thing, though, I had no interest in wanting to play Shadow the Hedgehog at the fuck all. Then why do you want to let's play it? <laughs> but Damn. I would. I'd be. I'd be better off watching it. <laughs> and you fell asleep you through it. Sleeping one of them. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, I sure did. Cause goddamn, I got sick of seeing the ending of Android Shadows sex toy clone Shadow. What the fuck? <laughs> Out of context. That's, not, only happened that's, twice. that's how random it fucking this was. Like Shad Shadow <laughs> would be a fucking hero, and then all of a sudden he just hates the world. But no, well, yeah. no, I'm right. like, you know, don't steal the gun this quick. You know, you know, you know, honestly, if you thought that was bad, imagine doing what I'm planning to do, and that's just, like, you know, doing the Noah method, which is like spinning the wheel all the time, but attempting to get all the paths. That would be hella redundant. Didn't we do a Triard playthrough that got canned to doing all the paths? Yeah. I really? Know, you were just, by the end of it. Yeah, you no. Well, like, I literally well, was, I was like, I was playing two routes uh, a night, just so we only had to get together to do five sessions. Yeah. Well, like for for Jeremy's little thing, I only had to play one route because Kevin would have played the second route afterwards. Literally, when we did that shit, the first session, Noah did one route, and I can't remember what the fuck it was. He was like, yeah, we're going to do this all the way through, and now Shadow hates the world, he's an android. What? That's the very first run. I was like, what? 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 You, know, you know, I thank y'all, you know, I thank y'all for bullying me to 100% crash, because now I, be I, I became to really like these games now, so. Have you, did Hell you yeah. 100% yeah. crash 3 yet, or no? I, I barely Air started it. I'm, working on it. I'm, working oh. I'm just taking a break. Pressure. pressure always wins in the end. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's a bad message to teach people. Yeah, but it works for John, so who cares? <laughs> so the question is, no, right? Like, Mark might be a bad friend. Are we also doing Crash Team Racing Adventure Mode? Is that a thing? I don't know. I, I don't know how far I'll, I'll go, but I do want to cover spinoffs. In the fun. back burner. Let's do the trilogy first, then we'll talk. Yeah. I, was gonna say, I mean, oh, come on. It's on the PS1. I'm going to break this man's back. Oh, God. Pause? Hey, me. Look, the man is losing his crash virginity card. Okay, don't be speedy. Oh, fuck that, he damn dude. near lost it. He might as well say he lost it when he said Crash One was his favorite game. I mean, he said it was his favorite to one hundred percent. You know, there are two different things. He, he also prefers this more than Crash Two. For now, I know he, he's wrong, but yeah. like you know, I, <laughs> he's, I still love my friend. I mean, I still, he's an idiot, but I, I mean, still, come on, I we, still we kind of do, but he gives some time because I just recently played Crash Two and it was kind of annoying, but. Who knows, if I 100% it again, <coughs> then I'll see. Once you get your yeah, no. little secrets. Crash, Look, I'm gonna be, I'm Crash gonna be honest. Crash 2, I, if you I know exactly like, what you're doing with Crash 2, it's the best. It is. I do like, I, I do like Crash 1 a lot, though, you know? Yeah, yeah I just, just play regularly. Like, if, it. if I'm 100 percent it, then I'm just prepared well, to kick okay. myself in the go now. Okay, I'm 100 it when it's the original. I was gonna say, if, if it's insane, I have no issue with 100%ing it. It's the original that's more so like. Well, uh, yeah, it's and brutal. Even then, and, even th and even then, after Crash 4, I, I don't care anymore. <laughs> Crash oh, 4 is so much worse. Did you 100% Crash 4? No, I, I, I quit after Bears repeating, but I know it got fast, but. but no, I, I you sold. did it, right? No, he didn't either. Oh, damn, that actually killed no, me. No, I didn't. I didn't. I thought he yeah, was no, on the back. No, no, Tom did it. Tom has. Tom oh, has. yeah, because he's a he's a PlayStation oh, yeah. trophy nut. Oh, yeah, yeah, but Tom, 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 Tom needs help. <laughs> no, Tom, yeah, Tom was, he wasn't the same after that. That man, like, platinum like, trophy bucket I, on, right? That is, like, a bucket list thing for me to do to 100% oh, yeah. game, but, like, fuck. Dude, I, no, that's my, my box, my, uh, my, like, my fucking bucket list is just getting all the gems, cause like I can't stand going for like platinum relics or higher. No, like I don't. We don't have to go for platinum relics. I just want to go for a relic. No, but in, get... Crash, in Crash Four, to get a to get the full completion, you do need to get platinum. What? Yeah. You Why? have to get platinums. What? And, oh, and that's it's just like Crash Three. Crash Three is the same thing. Like you get a better. No, 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 Crash Three. Crash three, you can finish the. You can get a. You can get the the secret ending with just sapphires. Wait, don't you get a gem no, from Coco no, 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 no. for getting? The, no, you okay, get no, you no, get a gem from Coco for getting gold or higher. 
Yeah, yeah, one of one of yeah, one of five percent is still gold, but like for Crash Four, you do need platinum. Yeah, yeah. And you then silent. <laughs> and then cra and not only that, but like you also need to go for a perfect run each for each level. Yeah, the insanely perfect relics. What? Oh man! So, oh so yeah. wow! So you have to get every like you know no, all the gems. You have, you have to get. You have to get all the gems, which requires you to get like you have to fill up a meter. You have to break all the boxes. You have to get the hidden. You have to get a hidden gem and oh fuck, I forgot about this. And you had to die less than three times. So has God in the Great done more, has God in the Great done that already <laughs> or not yet? He makes it sounds. Has huh? who? Wait, what, who said what? Has God in the Great done Crash Four? He... I'm pretty sure he has. Yeah, I have to look it up though. It's not. Some of the levels aren't as bad as you might think it is. Yeah, but it's just doing it. But it's doing it for all of them, including the hard ones. Is where it's like, okay, stop. Honestly, no. don't even don't even bother doing it in your first run. Do a few runs. That was no, the, the, the guys. Moxie and Dimension can fuck right off. That was my mistake when I first played Crash Four. When I played Crash Four, I did try to play it like it. with the. Okay. But no, last, but the, an the animal riding one was the worst, but the rest. That's of the what I'm saying. Like the that level fucking sucks. Oh did my. They Jesus. fix it. They probably did. They fixed it, but like, if they fixed it, but like, it's still a that level in particular is a bitch because of all no. the hidden shit. That's no, true. That, yeah. that, that, that was what that was what got me to quit Crash Four because it's like I tried that, and my first mistake was trying to go for a hundred percent on my first playthrough because I figured, hey, it's gonna be like the original trilogy, so why not? And then. When I realized how annoying it was to get everything, I still kept going for it, but I quit when Bears Repeating came in. When Bears Repeating came in, I was so mad, I literally uninstalled the game. Like, I was so pissed off. Yeah. And then when I saw what the actual completionist was, I was like, nah, this game's not worth it. Like, I'll probably, I, and I kept telling myself, I'm gonna come back to Crash 4 one of these days. Uh, I, keep, I, I, I keep, do think the game's worth it, personally, because well, it's the a game. Is, game. The, the game is good, but I will probably... I the game's it's, damn good. 100% the game is fucking fantastic. Of all time. It's in my it top is five favorite. favorite. It is my think, favorite game. It might because be I think two or three for me. I still prefer like, the original trilogy, the insane versions, and Crash Team Racing, but it's pretty. It's like in the top five in my ranking. So. I would like, rather 100% Crash 1 on PS1 than 100% Crash 4. And well, that's like yeah. a no contest. I would rather play Crash 4 than Crash 1. Oh yeah, one hundred percent. Like I'd yeah. much like, rather play I think Crash, Crash, Crash One. I think Crash Four is so fucking strong that not being able to do the completion, while it's disappointing, it's still one of the best experiences I've ever had with this Bandicoot. It doesn't ruin the game personally. Like it's more of a this yeah. is a thing to work towards, but still beating the game feels fulfilling. Yeah. And I'm part of me was some sick a sick mindset is that like in a way it actually brings me back to when i was younger where i couldn't 100 percent any of these games when i was a kid yeah it's yeah that weird it's the hunt that makes it really oh i fucked up yeah but i mean how much time do we have now 21 minutes and 14 seconds i have 28 minutes on my recording so yeah well i started literally as i as i started playing the level but Oh, that's for true. Up the All creek, right. you can get the uh, box jam, right? You can. Yes. Okay, figured. Yes. Um. So while we're on to this, I mean, I haven't played Crash Four yet, and I would like to one of these days. I, oh my, I almost died. I would like You'll to. You'll like it, but I like highly it. recommend just playing it. Don't one hundred percent it at all in the first yeah. one, dude. Dude, yeah. I'm about to, and... I have an idea for Crash Four. For Crash Four, let's play. So. Like we get we get the we get all the Crash Four. It's about time version, but then we get three other people to play Wrath of Cortex. <laughs> that is Christ. so stupid. That would, that would be funny, but like honestly, I think uh, if we did like we, we just, just since you can watch all the since you can watch all the cutscenes from replaying levels, we can just like we can get our save files and we can all just pick our favorite costumes with Crash and or Coco, and that'd be yeah. different enough experience. Don't you also play different characters too? Like, like Cortex. You can play as Cortex. You can play as. You can, you can play, play as Cortex, Cort Dingo, Dial, Tana, Crash, and Coco. Yeah, there's like a lot of different yeah, characters. Three, three of those characters yeah, are like optional levels. Oh, it's one of those games. Well, yeah. not exactly. 
I was like, I was like, yeah. they, I was like, well, they, yeah, you, well, you their first you levels you are mandatory, but their other levels are optional. I was yeah, like, wait, wait, I, I think I know what John's talking about. Yeah, you don't pick those characters. Like, they're just lines. They're just um, levels yeah. assigned for those characters. It's not Sonic Adventure yeah. one. Oh, I was, exactly. like, I was like, it's not Mario and Sonic at the Olymp at the whatever no. modern Olympics it is, where they leave no. fucking mm -hmm. Zavok for boxing only or some bullshit. Not. No. No, it's yeah. literally the way the game works is that when. Let's say Crash and Coco are in one spot. This character is doing a an a bridge thing somewhere else. Hmm, that's crazy. Yeah. They, they, could, the most, they, they always help out in the most inconvenient way possible, which I think yeah, is the, hilarious. The unfortunate part is a lot of the characters are genuinely fun to play, but they're, the levels you get after their first one are only half their level, because once because <laughs> there are portions in the regular levels where you get unwitting like something happens in the environment and the level changes usually a character helps you out somehow uh, uh, play, playing their other levels shows you how that happens and then you play the rest of the level as you did before but a harder version of it that's one of the i think that's another issue with completing crash 4 there's a lot of redundancy like you know like yeah. there's gonna be a lot of points where you're gonna have to repeat the levels and i haven't even touched on the the inverted stages like this is this is oh why yeah it happens honestly I'm really excited for them to like continue with how f great and fluid Crash Four feels and then maybe learn from some of the mistakes. Yeah, like like Crash Four as a whole, like as a game, is great. My biggest like yeah, top like three gripes: fuck hidden boxes in every goddamn level damn here. Holy shit! Yeah, they need to get rid of them. If you want to hide anything, hide the hide the gems. Oh my god! Like, I, I'll, dude, I gems holy shit. Is fine. The hidden gems are fine, but hidden boxes, you need to Dude, what just the give fuck? up on that. Ripperoo literally jumped on me as I did the victory animation. Fuck. <laughs> what? Oh, wow. No, no, I, I survived. I'm, I'm not dead, but that's oh, just so crazy. Okay. I oh, you want to know what's fucking crazy? The last time, like, when I was playing Crash 1 casually, which was, like, last week, literally, I, j I killed him, and I was on a TNT crate that fell off the waterfall, and I died, and I had to redo it. Oh, oh no. that sucks. <laughs> Oh, I'm at the Lost City. This is gonna be fun. But. Yeah, no, like, other things, like, get rid of hidden fucking boxes. Um, calm down with the 100% or 3000% completion status. We're gonna keep playing the game, guys. Don't worry. Uh, well, I'm not, I'm not even talking. I think, uh, all the optional gems is a good idea. Especially if it leads to costumes, which I think is a really cool reward. I would say, the only thing I would say is get rid of hidden boxes. I don't mind insanely perfect relics, but don't make them mandatory for. Yeah, I was gonna say maybe not for like maybe don't don't make like it like a thing. like yeah like maybe like a, a, maybe, maybe it could be like a PlayStation trophy, but like not in game hundred mm -hmm. percent. And let the re the relic requirement go back to gold or higher. I think that's fair enough. And give us the crash dash instead of the stupid spin. The oh my god! Yeah, garbage. I fucking hate that yeah. thing too. Why? It, it, it gives you carpal tunnel, I swear. Well, if you're gonna give us a spin, make it work how it doesn't rumble. You know what? Yeah, Start of the game, well, this is just a request. Fuck out of it. This is just a request. Give us fucking the death tornado spin, or that triple spin shit at the start of the game. It'd be fine. Like, you don't have to make it a reward if you make anything a reward. Give us the fucking speed shoes. I swear, if, you gave me, if they gave me the speed shoes in Crash 4, I'd care about doing relics. I'd actually care, even if that didn't get jack all fucking shit. So you get the same reward as you do for completing Crash 2 on Insane Trilogy. Yeah, you get the speed shoes on Crash 2, but to be fair, some, some of the levels in Crash 2 aren't built for relics. Yeah, because relics weren't yeah. a thing until Crash 3, so... Yeah. It's kind of funny. It's kind of, also, it's kind of an issue with Crash 1 as well, but worse. <laughs> no, with Crash 1, you don't even get the fucking shoes. Yeah, you exactly. Don't get, and, uh, I think that's for the best, honestly, because those levels would not those be levels. well with them. Yeah, the levels were not designed. Imagine doing the, the bridge levels shoes. with the shoes. Oh man! God, imagine doing slippery that's climb gross. and slippery climb with the run shoes. Oh, that's stop talking. <laughs> hey, stop let, talking let him cook. Let him, let him cook. Let him cook. Let him cook. Yeah, no, that'd be. I'm, don't let me cook. I'll burn it. That's just ass. No, no, he, he's just gonna make it garbage. <laughs> if you keep if you, if you keep cooking, you're you're bound to give someone food poisoning. Oh my god, fucking Man. All right. Currently so focused on Lost City right now. So how do you, how long have y'all been Crash fans? Like at least for a decade, maybe. Uh, okay. Shit. I'm, 
How old am I? <laughs> um, <laughs> here, John. Uh, John. 24 crash. years. Oh, fuck Did me. I didn't realize that was him. There's too. no way you're so, a Crash uh, fan when you're in diapers. Okay, wait. Hold yes, on. I was, actually. I was a fan I was when two I was years like old. Age, age four. When I was two years old. I was, and I, my parents will fact check me on this. Uh, is that like my oh, good. my dad gave me a copy of Crash Bandicoot 2 I'm with so the PlayStation 1. I'm so sorry. I was Dude, about four. Dude, so, hear me out. His fucking username is NN Bandicoot. The fuck else do you think he's a big fan of? I'm sure he's a fan of a lot of things, but. So, no, he ain't. <laughs> yeah, which, yeah, which is why I brought him into this, Mark. He like yeah. he likes Sonic and Sly Cooper and Ratchet and Clank. I, I mean, I'm gonna be 110 percent honest. Sonic is the only franchise. Sonic and Persona are the only franchises that are in my super fucking biggest fucking fan radar. Well, Crash, well, Crash doesn't appear often for you to be crazy. I mean, like, yes, there's like Crash fans, but I mean. We're just now getting Crash Cotton slowly, thanks to Insane Trilogy, because it pretty much revived Crash after... So, for, and as for me, so I, I've been outspoken about this, but Pokemon Yellow was the first game I played, but that was like on a handheld system. In terms of consoles, my uncle gave me a PlayStation 1, and the first game I played on that system was Crash Bash. Yeah, oh. we had like a, a surplus of Crash games in the house. Like, we had Crash Bash, Raptor Cortex, we actually had two copies, because one of them didn't work. We had CTR... When Crash Cortex, Cortex never works. <laughs> we had Pen yeah, man fucked with blue discs. Fucking blue disc, bro. That's the literal reason why I didn't goddamn work. Um, let's see. Yep, we had Crash Two, Crash Three, and that's about it. And then I remember slowly over time, I got more Crash stuff. We got Twin Sanity, Nitro Kart, Crash of the Titan. Like over the years, like. I wasn't one of those fans who got confused and was like, why does he have tattoos? Why why does he do this? Wait, why does I Crash just, have tattoos? Wait, what? Crash has tattoos? I think Crash of the Titans was the first. I think Crash of the Titans was the first Crash Bandicoot I actually fucking hated when I was a kid, not gonna lie. <laughs> no, <laughs> yeah. as a kid. I love like, Crash of the Titans. <laughs> Okay, no, no, no. Yeah. I, it was one of those. It was one of those games where it's like I liked it at first, but then over time I was like I hated the style. So it's like I had this negative perspective on Crash of the Titans. Especially like you know when I saw characters like Tiny, for instance, like I was so turned off by it. It was, was the first time. I was, I it was the first time laughing. I was. Yeah, it was the first time I got turned off by a Crash game. Um, no, it's, it's kind of uh, weird. Like, I think, hear me uh, out. Yeah, I love Crash Mind Over Mutant, but I remember, <laughs> like one year for Christmas, I asked my mom, and I always will say, like when it comes to my parents, if I ask for a game, they're gonna find a version of the game that's the cheapest. I asked yeah. for Crash Mind Over Mutant. Guess they what version it. they got me? The they fucking the DS, DS one. Yeah. I oh my it. god. Oh my god, that was the worst version of Crash Mind Over Mutant. Holy shit. Um. So. Um. Yeah. No. I like Crash. This <laughs> Crash is cool. It's a big part of my childhood. That's why I was I was so happy when the Insane Trilogy got announced. Actually, I was so happy to see it in Uncharted Four. I cried. I literally I cried. cried. I rewind. I rewind the video with the TV and told my dad to get in the room. <laughs> like I had to show somebody this. Yeah. Your dad played Crash. Oh yeah, my dad introduced me to Crash. Like he, my. My dad, two hundred percent at Crash Bash before I could ever learn how to do that. Brandy, I, I just remember my dad had really bad anger issues and broke our first copy. Damn. But we ended up getting another one. We've been on there. We how much did there. you guys hear of what I said? Wait, no, were nothing we, at all. Wait, what were you talking about? Discord decided to just break as soon as I started talking about my history of Crash. Oh, oh damn. Well, go ahead. Wait, Temple yeah. Ruins, this is a box gem, right? Before we get to that, or no? Is there a box? Well, what? You can get the box gem. Temple Ruins. You can yeah, get the box can, room. You yeah. can get it. Okay, we have 10 minutes. I think I might go farther than what we did when... Uh, you can go, Sean. You, can, you can talk now. Uh, um, I, uh, I I started playing when I was four, because I that's when I got a PlayStation 1 as my first console. Um, and I, I did the Noah thing of starting with Crash 3, actually. And then it oh. was Crash 2 and 1. Oh, we, uh, oh, yeah, I remember what I was going to say. I think I said this last time we played, but it's like, when I... I my copies were the collector's edition but for some reason i thought my the order was that crash bash was the first game and then crash team racing was the second leading up to crash yeah, yeah i remember that See, the spin-offs were the first games before the main line it's funny 
Yep. I, just, I mean, I, just I, mean imagine. I, might well, I might as well tell this story again then. Like, uh, I thought Crash Bash was Crash 1 because my cousins had the game. They had it in the Crash 1 box. And because I'm dis I was dyslexic even then, uh, I, I thought it said Bandicoot instead of Bash, or I thought it was short for Bandicoot. And for the longest time, I thought Bash was the very first game. I just imagine a parallel universe where it's like these random animals and a bunch of scientists get together to play fucking mini games and games together. Then they're like, you know what? Let's race instead. And then one of the scientists kidnaps a Bandicoot. I mean. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I love how fucking Mark was like, "Yeah, you idiot." You know, you know, Jer yeah. you know, you know Jeremy. <laughs> it's very linear storytelling. Yeah. You know, Jeremy. I wonder what what made you want to buy me Crash on Switch? Because I just wanted to say, John, I want to gift you Crash Bandicoot on Switch. Because like, you played nothing else. Damn. I'm not gonna lie. I thought I thought John might be more interested in Spyro because you know Spyro is kind of like, kind of like. Super Mario 64. I haven't even played Spyro of. yet. I mean, there's, I have a gut feeling you'll probably. I think you would probably like Spyro more. I just have a gut feeling. I mean, I, I think casually, like, Spyro is probably a more enjoyable game than Crash. Crash is like one of those games where I just feel like, you know, it's the sweaty game for me. So, so Spyro is a chill game. The question is, John, do you prefer, do you prefer platformers more or 3D uh, adventures? Collectathons. Yeah, collect the I'm more of a platformer like guy, honestly. Like I, like, <laughs> like I have the underrated opinion that I prefer 2D Mario over 3D Mario because I grew up with platformers all the time. Hey, man. I don't think I don't think that's an unpopular opinion. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm, you could literally have a civil war with that opinion. Yeah, if that's the case, yeah. then he probably would prefer Crash. But as far as like yeah. Spyro, I think he would still like it. I'm trying to like it. I just gotta yeah, like, give it a sh got opportunity to try it at some point. Like I know it's available everywhere, even on my grandma's toaster. I bet I can play it, but like, shit. I wish I could play. Your it. grandma must have a really nice fucking toaster. <laughs> That's a yeah, really nice say, toaster. God dang. I was, gonna, I was gonna say I really wish I could play the games on a toaster. God damn, can I have it? <laughs> but, but yeah. You mean I can make toast and play shitty games? Hell yeah. But yeah, I mean, I know Jeremy got me Crash, and I mean, I when I first played it, I was. Really iffy because it, it was so hard and I was really bad at it. Like, yeah, no, Crash is a franchise that gets more rewarding if you're willing to stick with it. No, it is because like because yeah. the way I'm playing right now, I would not play this my first try, first time out of the fuck all. Like I'm already at 72 lives, and, and it's like damn, and I 100 percenting. Like I thought 100 percenting was like Dark Souls hard. No, no, not intended to make that joke again, but it's like shit. Okay, there we go. Lost City done. Oh, like, damn, I got that bandicoot in me. Like, I can go spinning and destroy boxes like He's me. got that bandicoot in him. <laughs> like, I, I go... told you, John, the, t the Game of Master guys had that bandicoot in him. <laughs> we have... The bandicoot! We have six minutes and 40 seconds left. We have oh, what? boy. Mm -hmm. uh, we have six minutes and 40 seconds. Left. Oh, I thought you said 40 seconds left. I'm like, what, what the fuck? No. <laughs> I'm done with this level. <laughs> I'm like, what? I, oh, yeah, I'm heading to and the... I'm heading to point, just end the video. <laughs> I'm heading to every journal's, journal's level, favorite level right now. Road to nowhere. You know, you know what, low key, John is in his Renaissance bag right now. If you really think about it, like he's getting the Dragon Ball, he's getting the Crash, he's trying new things. Shout out to John. Look at him. I'm, pr I'm proud of him. I mean, I've been into Crash a little, little sooner, but it's just I feel like right now I'm more invested to it than ever. Like I finally got that in me again because i mean i was when i 100 percent the game the first time but then it died out but then now it came back i don't know i really want the oh, i want to get a ps5 to try out crash 4 but i mean i don't know if i want to wait that you long you can get it it's you can get it on oh wait you don't have a ps4 my bad i mean i was gonna say like he wants to get the ps5 so he can have more excuse to play the ps5 basically yeah. i mean if you want to get a ps5 it's like the best time to get it it's three but four two. I mean, how many years has it been since the five's been out? Three. I don't want to know, honestly. Three. I don't think it's three. I think it, no, it came, out, it, it came in in 2020. So, four. So, we're working on four, basically. Oh, yeah. yeah, well, yeah, well, yeah it's, it, yeah, it's, it's, yeah. Oh, and they do have the yeah. slim now. I was gonna say, it's been like, how many years since it's been? Like, my, usually my, with PlayStation my, consoles, you want to wait like three, four years. My, because my, you're being my, brain, my brain just assumed we're still in 2023, not gonna lie. <laughs> yeah, because it was supposed to be in 2023. 
No, when it comes to PlayStation consoles, you want to wait for three or four years, because that way you can get them when they're not being scalped anymore. I didn't jump. Oh yeah, remember that PS5 scalping? God damn. I mean, that's I, okay. I am. You mean? Oh, that's okay. Scalping's okay. Damn. No, that's no. no that's, scalping. It's, 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 no, it's not. Damn. Um, no, fuck, it's, it's fuck scalpers. That's, I was about to say that, and then I died. I was like, okay. No, that's not as much of an issue anymore as it used to be. You know, where's everyone at, actually? Dude, I, I remember. In ruins. I'm in Sunset Vista. Oh God. Where Lost it. Ah. Wait, where are you Dude, saying? I remember, like when the PlayStation Five like first first came out, and they had the whole queue to buy it on the PlayStation website. Oh my God, I remember. I literally waited, like, waited while I was trying to get ready for work to get it, <laughs> and I couldn't fucking get it, or my order got canceled. One of them. Didn't you? Did, did your friend's mom get you a freaking um? Yeah, one of my friends, his mom was selling their PlayStation Five, and I just got it that way. <laughs> For a good oh, price or the scalpel? No, it was a regular price. It was like regular retail price you, with if, games. If you, if, if you were someone's friend selling their console and they and they sold it to you like a scalpel, I would have. I would have no. Them literally, literally, someone at work though was literally selling me or trying to sell me a PS5 for scalp prices. It's like, yeah. hey, I got a PS5. I, I was like, oh, okay, cool. Like, how much? Eight hundred dollars, bro. You can literally go to hell. <laughs> you can I remember that, bro. That's like the earliest stories I remember of you. Because I was set that in a stream a long time ago. I was fucking pissed. I'm like, really, bro? We work together. It's not, it doesn't even come with games! <laughs> we work together! <laughs> we see like, the world together! Dude, you can you see just... my face! I can tell you to go fuck yourself to your face! <laughs> like, you, you scum, that you scum shit! You sounded like, I, I, you sounded like, you sounded like the co-worker cheated on you. <laughs> yeah. Kinda did, honestly. You know, I, I actually did, I did buy the PS5 with a scalper price. Oh, oh yeah, I remember that. I remember when you got your PS5. But, I think because you're like, yep, like in it. the Frontiers, right? Yeah. Well, yeah, it was Frontiers, but like, it was also like I remember on eBay and Amazon. Like, I remember people were asking like fucking over a grand for the PS5. Ridiculous. And like when I saw it for like seven hundred bucks, I'm like, all right, I really want this for for Sonic. This is the best price I'm gonna get, <laughs> dude. I remember when PlayStation 5s were like $1,500, $1,600. I never you... saw a past uh, a 1300 so. so the PlayStation 5 came out in November 2020. All right, four-year so, anniversary. So. Let's go. Dude, that's fucking crazy. Okay. PS5s are still like hella expensive on eBay, but like they're not four digits anymore. Is, I mean, they're not like... I mean, you can... not as... eBay isn't... I mean, look, I, look I, I got my Xbox for like $300, and I'm pretty sure that's like the, you know, around the price range of the PS5 nowadays. I mean, I, I see yeah, PS5's like at Target. A, yeah, like, yeah, back in the day, like 2020 and 2021, like, yeah, good luck with finding it in a store. Oh, yeah, no, you, could, you couldn't find it. You really couldn't find it. You couldn't even see one. I remember I would see one, and I thought I found, like, a unicorn, because it was that rare. Dude, give it to like 2026. They're gonna be in stores a lot more common than the Switch. And then around 2026, the Switch 2 will be hard to find. I remember back when I worked at Walmart, because I can say that in the past now. Um, <laughs> I, uh. Oh my when, god. Um, when those would pop in stock, I'd be like, oh cool, that'll be here for a day. And you didn't snag one for yourself? Wow. So, no, so, I never so, did. so here's. So I have a story. I was at a mall. Um, the mall's called like Route 66, and there was a PS5 there, and I was with a friend, and I had started working, by the way, so it's not like I had all the money in the world. But it was like, I see it right there, and I'm like, oh my god, how much is it? It's like $800, and I'm like, fuck, I could technically buy it, like, I could still afford huh. it, but is it really wise to do it now? And to this no. day, I, like, I regret it, like, I regretted not getting it at the moment, but, like, now that it's easy to get one now, and it's... The price is more manageable. I'm like, I'm glad I didn't do it, but at the time I was like, fuck, it was right there. But like, the John, reason how much why... time we got? Like, less than a minute. Okay. Fuck, I'm really I'm about to Wait. beat Road to Nowhere. Wait, let me try to beat Lost City because I'm so close to getting the no, gym. If, I... no, if you're near the end of the level or past halfway, just continue playing. We'll, we'll still record. Like, well, I'll stop the moment everyone's finished for whatever they're doing. 
Oh fuck me! You know what? I hate this game. Uh, you know what? I I don't I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> I just died. <laughs> I just fucking died. I'm halfway through Paul. All right, Kong. All right. All right cool. We're nowhere beaten. Whatever. I'll just beat I'll just beat Lost I City fin- like a normal loser. Oh, I finished Boulder gosh. Dash. Mm-hmm. Oh man, let's head to Sunset good. Vista. All right, what's everyone at? I will say, I, I will say this. I played way better in this recording than the last. I have fifty health. Back then, I had like one digit. <laughs> fifty health, you mean lives? <laughs> huh? You mean lives? You mean, right. you mean lives? Yes, yes. Oh my gosh! Stop correcting me, losers. Epic Game Mark, <laughs> I knew what you were talking about. Thank you. Non- Thank you. Non- non- so, who, right. so, I hate you. so who was the first to the head? <laughs> I'm a, I just be Kong. I, I think that answered your question. Okay. Boulder Dash. All right, so we're gonna be on the lo- on the third island then. Yeah. So yeah. Where is everyone at? I just, I just arrived at Temple Rooms. I just got the heavy machinery. Yeah. I'm just... wrapping up road to nowhere. Okay. But yeah, guys, we're gonna continue on for with Crash Bandicoot. We're gonna go through. We're probably gonna finish on the second island and head to the third one, and then we can. All, I mean, I'm not sure. I mean, we can probably begin our. I mean, do you guys even plan to backtrack after you get all the gems, or are you gonna get well, like one gem and you go back? Or I mean, I couldn't get Lost City's gem. Even I was so close to getting it in this attempt, and I died at the end. So I might <laughs> next episode might be uh, Mark versus Lost City Chronicle. I don't know. Once I hit the lab, I know I'm just gonna start doing backtracking. I mean, I mean, Mark, if you're really if you're really close, you might as well just get the gem off screen. Yeah, I, yeah, I could do that. I mean. I was considering doing that if that was allowed, but yeah. You can. It's not, it's not like it's not. I, I, it's just, just one gem. Here's, here's the thing. I was close. I just died at the very fucking end. Yeah, I wanted then to then go for it. I mean, I yeah, go for it. Yeah, do it. Again, that's John's. No, you yeah. should do it just so you can save time and you can not fight Lost City the whole entire part. All right. While we're while we're uh, while we're doing the while we're saying doing our outros, I'll just do that right now. <laughs> But yeah, we'll see you guys in the next part for Crash Bandicoot. Fun time. And yeah, see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Bye. Later. Later. Later.